Hey guys, this is Speak About Digital, and welcome to this video tutorial on how to use AmpleNote. AmpleNote is a note-taking software designed to help you capture, organize, and share your ideas more efficiently. In this tutorial, we will take you through the different features and functionalities of AmpleNote, including how to create new notes, whether you're a student, a professional, or simply looking for a better way to manage your notes. This tutorial will show you how to get the most out of AmpleNote. So please consider giving me a thumbs up, otherwise I will go ahead and jump right into the AmpleNote tutorial. First, if you're new to the platform, you will need to sign up. You will find the link down below in the description. So go to the description of this video and click on the first link you find there. This will take you to the correct sign up page. First, click on the Start Your Free Trial button to begin the account creation process. After this, you'll need to create a strong password to secure your account. Once you've created your password, click on Create Account to complete the process. After you've created your account, you'll need to add your profile information. This includes entering your full name and uploading your profile photo. Once you've completed this step, you'll be taken to your account dashboard where you can start exploring all the features and functionality of AmpleNote. The dashboard of AmpleNote is the central hub where you can access all the features and functionality of the platform. Once you log into your account, you will be directed to the dashboard, which is designed to be user-friendly. The left navigation panel is a crucial part of the dashboard, providing easy access to the important tabs such as Profile, Jots, Notes, Tasks, Calendar, Shortcuts, and Tags. From these tabs, you can create, organize, and manage all your notes, tasks, and other items. First, I'll show you what you can actually find in AmpleNote, and then I will show you how we can use AmpleNote. The Profile tab allows you to manage your account settings and preferences. By accessing this tab, you can customize various aspects of the platform to suit your needs and preferences. One of the key features of the Profile section is the ability to customize plugins. This feature allows you to add or remove specific plugins from your account, depending on what you need. The Help Center is also accessible within the Profile section, providing an easy way for you to access resources and support if you encounter any issues or have any questions about the platform. Additionally, you can share AmpleNote with others using the Share AmpleNote option available in this section, which is particularly useful if you're working on a project with others and want to collaborate effectively. Another great feature of the Profile tab is the ability to turn on or off dark or light modes to optimize the platform's appearance to your liking. This feature allows you to customize the visual appearance of the platform, making it easier to use and reducing eye strain or fatigue. The Jots tab allows you to quickly capture and write down ideas, notes, and other pieces of information without any distractions. In AmpleNote, every jot is a note, which means that every jot you make in the Jots tab becomes a note in your AmpleNote database. The purpose of Jots mode is to facilitate simple, quick idea capture. This feature is particularly useful when you're brainstorming or just starting to sketch out an idea and its connections. Jots mode provides a zero-clutter, distraction-free place to write enabling you to focus solely on your ideas and not on any other distractions that may hinder your thought process. The Notes tab allows you to edit, organize, and publish content. When you're ready to refine your ideas and take them to the next level, Notes mode is the perfect place to do so. Within the Notes section, you can view completed tasks, making it easy to keep track of your progress and stay on top of your goals. Additionally, you can view backlinks to related notes, helping you to connect and organize your ideas in a way that makes sense. One of the great features of Notes Mode is the ability to add collaborators to your notes. This feature allows you to work with others in real time, making it easy to collaborate and share ideas with your team or coworkers. Finally, Notes Mode allows you to secure your notes with Vault Encryption, which is available with the Unlimited and Founder plans. This feature ensures that your notes are protected and kept confidential, giving you peace of mind and ensuring that your sensitive information stays private. Tasks mode in AmpleNote is a powerful tool for planning and prioritizing your work. While every task lives in a note, Tasks mode provides a way to view all open tasks across all notes, making it easy to keep track of everything you need to do in one place. Within Tasks mode, you can apply filters to narrow down the list of tasks, helping you to focus on the most important items. 
You can also expand the task details to assign urgency, change the recurrence, hide the task until later, and more, giving you full control over how you manage your tasks. One of the most helpful features of the tasks mode is the task scores. These scores update as you change the properties of the tasks, allowing you to surface the top priorities and identify what you should work on next. This feature is especially useful when you have multiple tasks to complete and need to prioritize your work effectively. Calendar mode enables you to schedule and complete tasks with maximum ease and efficiency. It provides a drag and drop way to schedule your most important tasks on your calendar. This feature is designed to help you stay on top of your schedule and keep track of all your commitments. One of the key benefits of calendar mode is that you can set up different task domains to pull content from separate source notes and external calendars. This means that you can keep all your tasks organized and in one place even if they come from different sources. Unscheduled tasks from the domain's source notes are listed in the sidebar, making it easy to see what tasks are still pending and need to be scheduled. You can then simply drag and drop these tasks into the calendar to schedule them for a specific date and time. The Shortcuts tab displays all the jots, notes, tasks, and calendar items that you have starred for quick access. This feature is especially useful if you frequently use certain notes or tasks and want to access them quickly without having to navigate through various modes or search for them. By starring an item, you can easily add it to your shortcuts list, ensuring that it is always within reach. The Tags tab helps you categorize and prioritize your notes. Tags are a way to attach keywords or labels to your notes, making them easily searchable and organized. By assigning tags to your notes, you can quickly retrieve important information and filter notes to narrow down your search results. Tags in AmpleNote provide a flexible way to manage your notes. You can create and apply tags to multiple notes, helping you group and organize related information. With a few clicks, you can view all the notes associated with a specific tag, allowing you to easily navigate and find what you're looking for. Another advantage of using tags in AmpleNote is the ability to prioritize your notes. By tagging notes with priority levels, you can quickly identify the most important tasks or ideas and ensure that they get the attention they deserve. Additionally, tags make it easy to share notes with others as you can quickly filter notes with specific tags and share them with relevant parties. Now, creating new notes in AmpleNote is a simple process. Once you are on the dashboard, you can start creating a new note by clicking the New Note button located in the top right corner of the screen. Clicking this button will switch to Notes mode and open a new note for editing. In the title bar of the new note, enter a descriptive title that summarizes the contents of your note. This will make it easier to find and reference later on. You can also add tags to your note in the Tag section located under the title bar. Use specific keywords related to your notes as tags to make it easy to categorize and search for them later on. After entering the title and tags for your note, start writing down your notes in the body of the note. You can customize your notes using the toolbar, which allows you to make the text bold, italic, or strike through. You can also highlight important points in your notes to make them stand out. If you need to collaborate with others, you can do so by clicking on the three dots located at the top right corner of your note next to the title. From there, select Add Collaborators. A pop-up window will appear where you can enter the username or email address of the person you want to collaborate with. Once you've added them, click on Add User and the note will be shared with that user. Finally, if you have an unlimited or founder subscription, you can publish your notes so that others can view them. This can be done by clicking on the three dots at the top right corner and then clicking on the Publish Note. And there you have it, a beginner's guide to using AmpleNote. You can check the links in the description. That helps a lot, thank you. So again, if you found this video helpful, please give me a thumbs up, and if you have any questions at all, please comment below. I try to answer all the comments the best I can. Thanks for